Here we are, Sunday lunchtime, uh, we're all going to the holiday centre. Uh, Donald Featherston tribute weekend, where we're uh, playing out some early Italian wars, set in 15-12. A little bit of a what if, where the Swiss have joined forces with the Venetians, driven south into Italy, met the French and the Milanese in the first battle, while the uh, Spanish and the Papacy were fighting against the Florentines and the French. So a number of fights along the way. So we've had four battles so far, culminating in the battle we have here, which is one large battle with all forces. The French have finally unified and got all their forces together along with their allies. The uh, Imperial forces, which we can see here, are engaging along the front. The villages are key, so these have victory points, or their objectives, for the uh, opposing sides. So if it's on your half of the table, it's worth one victory point. If it's on the opposing side, it's worth two victory points. We also have the camps laid out on the rear of the table. They're worth three points. But the camps are a way off. Most of the fighting is engaging here. The guys are at lunch at the moment, hence the, uh, the quiet. <laughs> Some of the original Peter Gilder knights. These are Hinchliff. A couple at the front there of Citadel miniatures, but the majority of those are Hinchliffe. Very, very nice figures. There's Chris Cornell's chaps. More of the Wargame Centres. Wargame Holiday Centre, should I say. There are some of our Milanese and French pipe blocks. Some French knights, gendarmes, they are Italian allies. Some Landschnecks in French service, fighting against the Swiss. Real old ding dong going on there. The little crib sheets for the battalia, uh, you can see these strips on the table. The guys obviously use that for guidance and uh, want it visible to them on the table, hence them left in, it's a little bit of a, an eyesore, but you know, we're, it's a war game, not a demonstration. More of the Swiss engaging their arch enemies, the Landschnecks. Some of the Italian households. Some of the fine work by uh, Chris there, along with some of the War Games Holiday Centre. And then some of the work that's been done by my mate Fraser Ketteringham, VK. Von Ketteringham. They look very nice, Fraser. Hope you like them. These chaps are new additions for Chris, these ones here. Got more Landschneck, Bande Neri, and Italians. Florentine Pike there by uh, Nigel Appleby's, or from Nigel Appleby's collection. I think I'm right in saying these are Richard Allen Hanson Smith's original figures. And the guys in the front, the Arquebus, are from Chris's collection. Now 
Now we're using the current chair as uh, the holy relic from the, the papacies. Uh, basically that gives anything within 12 inches a plus one to any relevant save. So whether that be a brake test, a morale save, or ultimately if it gets destroyed, there's a minus one to all of those saves I've mentioned. We've got some hefty fighting going on in this built up monastery area. Between the Spanish and the Landschnitz. And the French service. So still a lot to be played for. An excellent weekend all round. 18 gamers, 19 on Saturday. And we'll get a result before four o'clock. So all good.